the Lord be with you and, and with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. Glory to you, O Lord. Chapter 6, verses 35 to 40. Jesus said to the crowd, I am the bread of life. He who comes to me will never be hungry. He who believes in me will never thirst. But as I have told you, you can see me and still you do not believe. All that the Father gives me will come to me. And whoever comes to me, I shall not turn him away. Because I have come from heaven not to do my own will, but to do the will of the one who sent me. Now the will of him who sent me is that I should lose nothing of all that he has given to me, and that I should raise it up on the last day. Yes, it is my Father's will that whoever sees the Son and believes in him shall have eternal life, and that I shall raise him up on the last day. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. My dear brothers and sisters, in today's Gospel we hear Jesus is facing the problem of unbelief in spite of the signs that he had worked among the people. He knows the will of his Heavenly Father because he is deeply united with his Father in prayer. God wants everyone to believe in Jesus and have eternal life. The first reading of today gives us the glimpse into the life of the early Christian community. Though they are persecuted and scattered, they continue to proclaim Christ wherever they go. And the Lord continues to work wonders through them. When difficulties come our way, how do we respond? Are we like the persecuted Christians of the early church, proclaiming Christ in spite of adverse circumstances of life? Let us ask God to deepen our belief in Jesus.